Well, our weather is going to look nice. It's going to feel pretty nice temperature wise, but we are going to see these winds kick again. And that means the uh, weather watch is up or the fire weather watch is up, high fire danger. And all the precipitation we got, which some of us got very little on that last system, even though we had all those big storms, uh, that's pretty much evaporated with the high winds, the open skies, and the warm temperatures. Our pattern right now is a big ridge of high pressure. This thing is elongated all up, all the way up into Canada. It's just a big ridge of high pressure, big clockwise circulation. The flow pattern is from the northwest to the southeast, but mainly north of us. So you can see the areas of uh, weather that move through. You can see it push it to the southeast. We're also watching this area of lower pressure out here because what's going to happen is this is heavy air that's working in the Gulf of Alaska. When that goes over the top of that ridge, and that ridge is kind of narrow at the top, because of the weight of it, it'll go over the top and that ridge will be suppressed a little bit southward and southwest, so then the track will be more down toward Texas. So we'll move a front down. We're okay insofar as it looks now in getting garden variety showers. And that'll be late Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. But if we pick up one of these little areas of low pressure underneath that ridge and bring it in toward Texas, you not only enhance the Pacific moisture, you also enhance the Gulf flow, warm moist air, and you get a more volatile atmosphere. What creates the showers is the vertical velocity or upward motion and around a low pressure area, the dynamics are counterclockwise and up. So you put a little low into play and then you've got a potential for stronger storms. So we'll be keeping an eye on that. In the meantime, under the ridge, everything's very quiet for us. We haven't seen much in the way of cloud cover. Temperatures right now, they're coming down. They're in the 60s, a few 70s out to the southeast of us. The lows tonight will be in the 40s and 50s. Not that cool of a night, a little bit of a chill. Winds are trying to shift. They're coming in from the east and southeast and they're generally light. So we'll start 48, go 87. The winds kick, so we're windy, warm and windy, warm and windy. Clouds come in late night to showers. The cold front Wednesday morning, not so cold, kind of pleasant finishing the week. That's the way it shapes up, Chris and Leslie. I'm liking the spring forecast. Thank you so much, Bill.